Welcome to the video. The gang's all here. I was researching this. You know, how in the world does anybody know if it's jade or jadeite? Or anything like that. It has some nice dark inclusions. I really don't know. So, I just sell it for $18. It is some kind of a stone bracelet. I don't know how you get it on. I mean, I could get it on if I forced it, but I'm just not going to. Now this, Alaska's finest quality, Arctic Opal 14 karat ear wire. I looked it up. It's azurite, which is malachite and lapis, I believe. I need mean, this looks vintage. It's vintage. Um... Let me see if it says 14K on. These have brand new ear wire. That thing, that whole thing is 14K? I don't know. Is it marked? I'm gonna have to take this back off and set it down and look. ear it's not marked so seeing that it's not marked we're not going to charge for gold I mean if it's 14k great it says it is but you know now this goes with it, but what is it? Is it like a, to clip on the, um, to clip on what? To clip on like a chain or something? Necklaces? I don't know what that is that needs to be cleaned. I think you could polish that up pretty good. I don't know. So it goes with it. $38. I know that they go for a lot more. But I don't see that it's stamped 14K. So, you know, we're just not going to worry with that. And um, it is vintage from what I understand. So you can get the nice big, they're nice size. Where's my dime? Here's my dime. This is like almost a quarter and this is, or a nickel bigger now, almost a quarter. So that's how it will come. They're very polished and they have a coating. So if you're expecting something that looks really like a rock it's not it almost looks fake but it's not so you might want to look it up if you're interested in it to see because it's arctic opal or whatever now we're back to the um to the box that was good you know how we were going through the box so I grabbed some more from the box and let me just show real quick. That's my email. So email me if you would like any information. Be glad to help you. These are Pier 1. Has some stone down here. $4. Made in India. Brass, stone, and bone. Brass stone bone. Thank you for clarifying. That is awesome. Brass stone bone. Yay. What was on here? This is a nice long gold tone chain by Avon. Upside down. Nice long, long gold tone chain. How long? 
probably 14 inches. Uh, $4. Howlite, stretchy, $4. This looks like it's a bunch of earrings or something. Uh, the craft bags have sold, but plenty of earrings left. We have to be careful with all these little staples. That's going to have to be thrown away. This is like a pendant, little hearts and stuff. I don't know. Oh, they go on here. There's not that many of these to go on there. So there's one, two, two are on there. This one looks, how does that work? It doesn't even look like it's going to work. Like silver tone hoop thing. I don't know. One dollar. Freebie. Those are nice. We'll bundle them with something. This looks like that. You know, there's like an image of a of the cherub. I've seen it in doctors' offices and stuff. One dollar. Let's put some backs on there. How's everybody doing? Well, I had an avocado and some chips because the avocados they gave us were soft. So that was what designated the dinner. Did not get to a salad yet because I got full after that. Now... This is like, um, it needs a toggle. It, it looks like it's garnet and a stone. And I don't really know. Your toggle will go around there or something. That's how it'll be. So I'm going to try to. So $4 as is for garnets. And some stone. Needs that tea. That came out of that last batch of stones, but I don't know that that toggle is going to be found at the bottom of all of it. I don't know what this is, but it's in a bag. I'm not going to open it. It's like an S with a wing, and it clips on, and it clips on, and there you have your lanyard, and it comes down. One dollar. That's pretty cool. I like that. You never know what's going to pop out. Like, for example, this, which is missing a stone, I believe. Just needs a little stone glued in, so we'll just say $2. You'll need to glue something in there. Oh, wait a minute. Avon we'll keep it at two dollars it goes all the way down almost to a nine everything's nice on it it's just missing one little sparkly something some more of these hematite this looks like it's 
Well, we'll leave it over here because it's short. We need more to be added. Here's a little piano. One dollar piano pen. It looks very good quality, but I don't see any marks. Wait, there might be something underneath there. P-A, P-A-O or something. It's really cool, a cool pen. A vintage ring. Really weird. I've never seen like a goldish color after the plating's rubbed off. I don't think it's a real pearl. Um vintage eight three dollars Hawaii black and pink beautiful three dollars leather Cross, ooh, pretty. Aurora Borealis going around each of the pieces of the cross. And then pearlish pearls, faux pearl. Vintage, this clasp is vintage, I think. Four dollars. So my bestie sister is sending an iPad, which is exciting. Then I don't have to borrow the phone and all that. Really nice, $2. Natural colors. Nice glass pendant, has some rubs on the back. Three dollars. Having my tea. Oh, this is an earring. There's just the one. Pink and hematite. Three dollars. Stretchy. This is like a charm bracelet type, one dollar. Earrings, one dollar for your mother of pearls and your blue hoops. Blue and black hoops, like a leopard print. One dollar for that bundle. That's a funky pendant. Funky. One dollar. Tangle. I don't think it's precious metal. It's all gold tone, glass. Um, that goes with it. I think it's just one necklace 
the tangle two dollars you get you it, it wants to stay with that gold tone bangle so we won't separate it pretty nice memory wire magnet easy to put on three dollars faux pearl soft leather nine two five awesome we'll just throw that over there we'll take it kathy lee judy lee judy lee vintage gold tone it's all there uh-oh there's no pendant huh you can put a pendant on there three dollars this you just press and it'll separate it's a really good one for a nice pendant palm tree with some rhinestones cookie lee three dollars michael saint michael What is this going to say? I can't, I don't know. I cannot tell. Is it sterling? It looks more like pewter. This is not sterling. I'm going to have to check that out. We'll have to test that. It'll come back around. Interesting bracelet. Really unique. Never have seen one like this. I'm just wanting to know if there's a mark. I don't see a mark. Two dollars. Vintage. Silver tone. Very different. Do more than just exist. I don't know if I like that. What do y'all think about that? do more than just exist freebie i think well i'll just keep my thoughts to myself living is a gift and just getting through your day and doing what you can this is broken freebie it's broken you're gonna have to this is gonna come off so I don't know how you get the this is just knocked off of there. Maybe you can be creative. It looks like it's a stone. Three dollars. I don't know that it living means you have to do anything. I mean we do we 
This is vintage, $4. I can't tell if these are glass. I think they are, but I'm not sure. Vintage rosary, black, $4. I just think naturally you'll be guided to do something, but this almost, this definitely looks um, southwest. I wonder. That's a. I don't see any marks, but we'll hang on to it in case we get some more. Um, carved plastic freebie. This is, oh my, this is a pen that broke. Look at that. It's a brooch that broke and they just bent that pin back LC and put it on here these are usually magnetic I can't get it apart It's twisting. Okay, it unscrews. Magnet, and then you screw that down. So be careful because it's it can poke you. Three dollars. Beautiful colors. It reminds me of grapefruit. I think Susan Gill has claimed these March so we'll just keep piling them up until we get through the box what a tangle there's got to be something in here but maybe not that looks good Will Billy Bob be lucky today? Time will tell. Is this marked? I can't really tell. Boy, is this an, a knotted. Totally knotted up. There might be sterling in here as well. This is very tiny chain links. Gosh. My goodness. I think I'm going to have to... I'm going to look at the maple leaf. I don't see any marks. This might be a diamond. It has that look where they try to make it look bigger. Go. 
You warm up the diamond tester. Undo all of the latches, but try not to lose track of the pendants, because if they come off, I mean all kinds of potential in here. I can't even put it down to warm up the diamond tester at the moment, because it's loosening up here. Trying to find the diamond, this one here. Loosening up is good. There's the possible diamond. Now, this looks like it's not going to be anything, but we will look. Let me warm up the... I don't think so. It's lost its plating on the necklace. Three dollars. Definitely vintage. Pretty leaf and faux pearl, I guess. I'm not going to tackle that right now. This is the one with the two hearts. One dollar. Vintage.
Pretty sure it's a diamond. You get it off that onto the metal and it's not I don't know. I think it's a diamond, but there's, um, it's not gold, but woohoo, Diamond Diva. I'm pretty sure that's a diamond, so we'll set that right here for her. A mesh bracelet two dollars. I believe we have a magnet here for your refrigerator. San Diego Vintage, one dollar. That is cool. Chains with pearl. This is tied. It must have, maybe it broke. I don't know. Champagne ish color, pinkish, stretchy, $3. Delicate little flowers. Pastel with some butterfly two dollars Sarah Cove hopefully we'll get the other one we are um, storing these in a box not mixing them in with others so when we get to the bottom of the box I believe these are, yeah, these are maybe rose quartz and some quartz and aventurine. It has a clasp. Wait. I can't find the clasp. Vintage, at that and the tail goes up and down it's a pendant I love it so cute big glass belly we'll hang on to that stretchy black and yellow glass two dollars Vintage little heart brace neck, yeah, bracelet. Kind of heavy, well made, two dollars. Look at this. What is this? This looks like it might be a locket.
no markings, pretty flowers, $4. Nice chain, nice design. Red, a red um, stone and plastic, three dollars. This was the bottle cap with glass or plastic. We had these in one of our other bags. Plastic, one dollar. I don't know what the design is. This looks vintage with some enamel black. Two dollars. More enamel, pink and dark pink three dollars three dollars golden tone and hematite little stretchy with discs crystals in there or rhinestones three dollars broken As is, nice pendant, missing some gold toning. Maybe you can clip, click the, clip this back on somehow, I don't know. You could if you're patient, but one dollar. Green, twisted, braided, rope or something I don't know it's not rope but with some rose goldish beading and some bling oh it's a magnet so you straighten these out and three dollars <coughs> Excuse me, one dollar. Vintage, we're hoping to get the others. By the way, the Coro, I guess eight dollars was too much. Uh, they're marked Coro on the back. Does anybody want them for five? For the two Coro. I'll take five for them. Scarf clip. Um, see if we can't bundle something. November. One dollar. Little pendant with a rhinestone, gold tone cross, and a scarf clip vintage, one dollar together. We're going to wait to try to get some more of those. And I will try to separate this. God bless. Thank y'all.